Hi everybody, long time, no see, hope everyone's okay, haven't um, done a video in two weeks um, so I thought I would give you a video today. So today I'm going to talk about one of the therapies that I actually practiced and have been trained in for the last, I would say, two year, year and a half, two years and it's a therapy called EMDR and it's, it stands for Eye Movement Desensitization and Reprocessing. But before I go on a little bit further about this um, therapy, please remember to subscribe, share and uh, like the video. And it's just, this is a free mental health channel just to help people understand what I do and get to grips with um, some of the content that I'm sharing. So let's go on with the video. So EMDR is about treating trauma primarily and nice guidelines that's the National Institute of Clinical Excellence um, have done lots of research in this. So basically if you can imagine that when you've been traumatized by an event um, your you might not even necessarily remember it all, but you'll kind of have all the physical sensations and it just becomes almost as if you're replaying that trauma in that moment. Um, or that trauma is happening to you. You can't distinguish because it feels so severe. So your heart might be pounding, your stomach might be churning. Um, your throat might go dry. You know, you might have a heady feeling. So that fight, flight, freeze almost as if you were there. What EMDR does is that it says we have two brain connections. So these two brain connections is the unhelpful part of our brain path, which um, keeps that trauma going. And we've not learned how to basically um, learn another, utilise another part of our brain to kind of balance out or kind of, you know, get rid of that kind of feeling we've just relied very much on one part of the brain so what emdr does by the use of bilateral um stimulation so it's the use of the eye hand movements there's vari there's a variations of them um what what it does is that it allows you to process the negative trauma by exposing you to it exposing you to that particular trauma and each and every time you do it your distress levels come down and your brain it's almost like being in REM sleep so if you can imagine when you're in that rapid eye movement sleep which is dream sleep that's when your your brain's making some of those changes in the exposure it, it almost feels like that so that's one part of it the other part of it is that you know because sometimes we believe such negative beliefs about ourselves once we've experienced experience trauma such you know i'm not good enough or it was my fault in emdr we try and shift that belief and we come up with a more positive belief about what you'd like to believe about yourself and we also use this strange thing called bilateral stimulation where it's hand movements where you allow your eyes to move from left to right left to right or you use some form of tapping or hand movement to aid that process. Now it's for some people that I've used this therapy with they've actually you know felt really really it's been amazing for them it's been absolutely brilliant for them and it, you know they've moved on from their trauma. I've had some clients say to me well you know um, I don't even feel that particular sensation anymore that negativity anymore I don't know what you've done Paula but it seems really, really helpful. And I get some people who think that it's not right for them. So for that, th for those people who that particular therapy is not right for them, I tend to use um, CBT um, for trauma, or sometimes I use my schema therapy, which I spoke about in a previous video. So um, there's also lots of support and resources thing, resourcing that I do with my clients. So that means it helps you prepare you, the client for feeling very grounded and emotionally safe so that's all for now if you'd like to make a comment or if you'd uh, like to access my services it's um 
paularetherapy.co.uk. Um, I'm easily Google. You can easily Google me, Paula Reed, which with the R E I D, or you can uh, follow me on Instagram, which is Paula Reed Therapy Services. I hope you all have a great weekend or a week, depending on which time you're watching it. And thank you for spending the time to listen to me. Bye.